I am debuting my book, Key West Changing Colors, my first travelogue book, in which I go to the very special places in which I think light, color, art history, and the overall personality of a place is very special. And to me, Key West is one of those. Yeah. I chose three different subject matters to paint. One is water. In approximately 15 different water watercolors, I tried to show all the different possible color variations that I experienced as an artist. It's a color show every day. Yeah. It's unbelievable how many blue colors. The second subject matter I adopted is flamingos, mm. which in 1832, when Audubon went to Key West, was pink. 175 years later, because of water contamination and diet, has changed to orange. So abstractly, I did a whole group of paintings, both watercolors and on canvas, that start with pink at the top, transition to orange at the bottom, they move left to right in each case. And the final series of paintings was all about sunsets, which is the most famous thing in Key West. Yeah. Thousands of people walk to the shores nightly to watch the sun go down. So I did 15 sunsets at different times. I set a high standard, I said I wanted to, prepare and publish this book, the finest place in the world. What's the finest? What's the best in the entire world? And the answer is Bruges in Belgium, and it has been for a couple centuries. And so my book is going to be available for a holiday gift, and I hope to do at least one a year for the rest of my art life. I'm very excited about it.